Hello everybody, it's your friendly neighborhood Matt here, and welcome to Would You Rather, a game that's pretty self-explanatory, gives you a couple scenarios, you have to choose between them. Let's jump right into it! That's what she said. Would you rather have no eyebrows or have a unibrow? Well, I actually did have a bit of a unibrow, um, back in younger years of grade school. Um, I'd rather... I'd feel stranger having none than having a unibrow, and it's kind of a strange question. I mean, I wouldn't... Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'd, would it have to be like a really thick Ed Ed Netty unibrow that... Or would it just... Could it be like subtle, like mine was? Would you rather save Abraham Lincoln or save John F. Kennedy? That's putting an awful lot of pressure on me, putting an awful lot of power in my hands, Lincoln. That's another one that's pretty much split down the middle. What are you supposed to say? Either way, you're an asshole. Because you didn't save Abraham Lincoln. Or you let JFK get shot still. As a leader, would you rather be loved or be feared? Loved. Hands down. If I'm playing Fallout, any of the Fallout games, I would rather be feared or I will massacre you. But, in real life, I would rather be loved than feared. Would you rather make out with Gollum or hook up with Beetlejuice? From, well, duh, from the movie. I mean, nope, Beetlejuice is going to come knocking on my door any second now. Hey, sex, now. Um, also, does it say how long I have to make out with Gollum? Uh, is the thing with Beetlejuice a one-night stand? Oh, I don't like this one at all. This is about to reveal some horrible personal things about me. Well, I like the Lord of the Rings movies, so... God damn it! People don't agree with me. Now I look like a sexually confused weirdo. Well, actually, I do regardless. Would you rather open up a can of whoop-ass on a fool or pity a fool? Well, let me just put it to you this way. If you want to see Steve Austin open up a can of whoop-ass on a fool, give me a hell yeah! Austin 316 says I just whooped your ass! Would you rather maintain eye contact with another person while eating a banana, or move your head down to the banana? Well, I'm a fan of comedy. You know I'm a fan of comedy. You know that I know that you know that I'm a fan of comedy. And I would much rather stare down each and every single one of you while I eat a banana, while moving my head down to the banana. Let me do both! Hell yeah! Would you rather live without your cell phone or live without your iPod? Can't cell phones nowadays play all the music that could have been on my iPod? My iPod is a small one. It's broken. It's in my room. The cream. This is the cream. The screen's all spiderwebbed. If you want it, you can fucking have it. I'll take my phone. Thank you. Mwah. That's cold. I'm taking it out of my pants. Would you rather string your opponent along for the entire fight, or crush them from the beginning? As powerful as I'd feel with the second option, I like the first one. I like to torture my prey. I like to make them suffer first. I have issues. And apparently a lot of people disagree with me. But you know what? You guys aren't any fun. Would you rather have to eat the same meal every meal for the rest of your life, or eat whatever you wanted except once a month you have to eat a doo-doo sandwich? Oh, crap. Uh, 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 question, is poop good for me? If I were to consume a shitty sandwich, would that... Ah, oh, god damn it. I mean, I'm obsessed with burgers, but if I had to have a burger for breakfast, lunch, dinner, breakfast, lunch, dinner, breakfast, lunch, dinner... But on the alternative, I could eat the way I do now, but have to eat a shit sandwich once a month. I'm gonna go burgers. I'm really gonna go burgers. It's not worth it. I'm not gonna put in a doo-doo burger just so I don't have to eat burgers every day. No way, no how. Would you rather suck a hobo's toe for two minutes, or be in a cage with a honey badger and lion for 20 seconds? Well, fuck me! I mean, I've had all my shots, but... Uh... Honestly, I don't know if I see myself surviving the first scenario here. Um, can the honey badger and the lion be asleep? If not, I'll be dead. But you know what? This first one's a fate worse than death. Fuck you. I'm staying in with the lion. Hell, I'll 
Dude, I'll suck the lion's toe for two minutes. Get me away from that guy. If you could attend only one of the two, go to the would you rather Super Bowl or World Cup final? I don't watch soccer. Football's my favorite sport. This one's a tough one. Uh, I'm gonna go to Super Bowl. Wow, really? Okay, um, okay, so half the survey was conducted in Europe, and the other half was conducted here in America. That's okay. I, d I don't watch soccer. I, I, it bores me, unless it's, like, the World Cup. But I wouldn't, like, go to the, I wouldn't choose going to the World Cup over going to the Super Bowl. Would you rather leave your 90-year-old grandmother in the car on a hot day with the windows up, or leave your dog in the car on a hot day with the windows rolled up? What kind of monster are you?! Sorry, Granny, you've had a very good run. I'm proud of the things you've accomplished, even if you can't remember them anymore. But, wow! I feel, I had a feeling I'd be an asshole either way, but, fuck me! Would you rather eat Nutella or eat bacon? WHY DO I ONLY HAVE TO EAT ONE?! Is this for like the rest of my life, or just in, in general, like on a daily basis, or by meal? Here's the thing, I don't use Nutella as often as I use bacon and things, and that's probably really bad. But I use bacon in a lot of meals, and I would hate to have to give that up. Would you rather fly like Superman or travel like Spider-Man? Spider-Man! Spider-Man! Immediately. Fuck you, Superman! I- I don't have to go, go so far as to say I hate Superman, but I fucking hate Superman. He is too- like, every power, really? And I know this is just about flying, but I fucking hate Superman, and I know this is coming from a Batman fan, but it's just, like, he never loses, and when he does, it's because of some bizarre fucking circumstance featuring this, some sort of alien crystal. It's like, stop. Stop. Fuck you. You win everything. Just pack your bags and go home. I would love to swing webs all throughout the metropolis or wherever I live in this location that doesn't have those tall buildings, but I would love to travel that way regardless. It'd be fucking awesome! Would you rather shrink to one inch or grow to three stories? Is it talking about my height or my penis? Let's weigh both of them. As far as my height, I could shrink down to one inch and do a... It'd be a magical world full of adventure of falling into a rabbit hole and into a world of madness. Would I be able to change back though? Would I be able to change back? I think it would be worse on me if I, as far as if I could never change back, I would rather shrink to one inch than grow to three stories. Um, I just think it would be even more difficult to sustain a living growing to three stories. Uh, I feel like you'd be viewed as more of a monster and the government's going to come by and blow your head off or keep you in a cage. In fact, they probably will either way. Oh my god! Are they monitoring my computer? No! On the other hand, if we're talking about penis, three stories. Oh, wait, no, it does answer. Oh, f f f fact. Let it not be said that this says anything about me as a person. I'm not going to reveal my penis size here on YouTube in a, in a would you rather video. Especially since half of my audience is between the age of 13 and 24. Would you rather be deaf or be Amish? Oh my god! Ah! Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I panicked there. It's just... It's, uh, whew. Would you rather lick a public bathroom floor or lick a public bathroom stall handle? What you didn't say is that I couldn't clean it off first. So I'm just gonna take some, uh, some good old wipes with me. And do I have to lick the whole floor? Uh, and how thoroughly do I have to lick the handle? These are things I need to know. Um, if it's the whole floor, I'd probably go with the handle because... Well, it, this is a very interesting dilemma. Can I wipe it off? I mean, if so... I mean, to be honest, the floor probably has more piss on it than the handle does. Me, I usually use my foot. So... Feet and piss are on the handle, and feet and piss are all over the floor. So it's really actually not going to be much of a difference. And I'm going to go with the handle, because I, I, there's really very little difference to what that's going to do to you psychologically. Would you rather burp extremely loudly every 30 seconds, I like it already, or let out a smelly, long-lasting fart every five minutes? How did they find out about me? Well, let's see. 
I want to be a voice actor, and so when I see this, the first thing is, okay, what, what, how will it affect my occupation? Um, burp extremely loudly every 30 seconds. Say I'm in a, a little booth, and I'm trying to record things, and that could really get in the way if I have any really long lines. Um, but if I'm in that same recording booth, and every five minutes I let out a smelly, long-lasting fart, I'm not going to be conscious for very long, because it's going to be trapped in there, and then I'm going to kill myself. Um, the other thing is, which one would be less convenient during sex? Um, there's a, this is, there's no way to win in this situation. So, I'm gonna stick with the recording booth death one and go, I'll just burp every 30 seconds. If your mom was about to die, would you rather marry an unattractive 64-year-old and drink your cat's pee every morning for breakfast in order to save her, or let her die? Oh, I'm gonna look like such an asshole! Oh, good. Whew! Sorry, Mom. Would you rather show your friends and family your entire internet history, or live near an active volcano? Now, I know what you're thinking. Volcano. 100%, right? Well, I use incognito mode so no one can ever learn what I've done anyways. Fuck, I'm still going to volcano. Wow, really? I th okay. Part of me was expecting that to be like low, but another part of me was expecting that to be like a hundred percent. Would you rather give a speech to the whole nation or have to sleep with tarantulas on your bed? Well, you, you're not. It's kind of one-sided. I mean, you're not really saying what kind of speech I have to give. It's not a presidential address. Uh, you never said I had to address like ISIS or something. It's like so I could just go up to the podium and be like. Kittens or, or puppies? I mean, I like both. They're, so, they're both so cute. But puppies are more to maintain. Cats are kind of there to take care of themselves better. But puppies love you more. And cats are like assholes. And thank you for your time. I'll let you fight this out amongst yourselves. And fight to the death. Kitties or puppies, what's your pick? Speech! Oh, hell yeah! Who the fuck are these 86,000 people who'd rather sleep with tarantulas in their bed than get up to the podium and be like, kittens, and then walk away? On that note, uh, that's actually a good one myself. See, I'm going to leave you with a little question as I end this episode here. Would you rather just kittens or, or puppies and explain why? So... Yeah, I, I expect to fight to the death in the comments, okay? Okay, thank you everybody so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to hump that like button into submission. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Just remember, stay saucy, my friends. Yes! Break it down! No, no! <laughs> Break it. <laughs> Excuse me while I do a handstand. <laughs> Yeah. Talk to the butt, cause the face don't want- oh! here we go! <laughs> There's a stool here. Whoa, wait, whoa, 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 what the hell? I broke the game! I broke the game! I broke it! Goodbye, cruel world! Bye! What? What? I just broke the game! <laughs>